But wait, you guys have already read the title, so I cannot fool you guys. The thing is, yesterday, somebody sent me an email uh, giving me the link to this guy's channel. It's in the description. You guys should definitely go and subscribe to this dude. The thing is, he shows a golden break. A, a break which basically I have never seen up till now. You know, in 9 ball pool and my battery's 10% remaining as always on the camera. Alright. So this is the aim, I mean this is where the cue ball is going to be placed, excuse me. It's pretty simple, you, anyone can place it or there if he has a finger in his hand. Now this break has nothing to do with this Kraken cue, so don't get upset. Now, okay, uh, it's going to be explained further on, but first, let us watch what happens uh, in the break itself. The only crucial factor is that you should have the digitalized cue, and look what happens. Alright, this is how this thing works, and I'm going to explain to you how, I mean, Possibly this, this explanation is gonna be wrong, but I think this is how it works as mentioned in the forum because there was a forum I don't know if I if I have told you guys up till now, but there was also a forum where this break was scientifically proven Not in the game, but in real life, and I think this was the logic if I understood it properly Now the cue ball should be placed over here, which is pretty simple. No rocket science needed This is the aim you can use any cue uh, you know to set the aim like this it doesn't matter but just just remember to switch to the digitalized cube before shooting and this is the spin it's pretty simple once again top right spin no big deal and um, now the real thing begins now he switches to the digitalized cube now look what happens guys okay full power come on come on okay now as soon as the cue ball hits the diamond I mean the collection of these balls Look how the 8 ball is just moving in a straight line. It's, it's just like moving in a straight line. It's going to come back to where it was in the same alignment. And when it comes back, now it's going to hit the 9 ball. And in a diamond, it's natural. Like if the 8 ball is going to hit the 9 ball straight, it's gonna the 9 ball is going to go to the top middle pocket. The similar way, if the yellow ball hits the 9 ball, it's going to travel in the same direction as it's traveling in this break. So I think this is the explanation that it's used. Uh, behind this break and I think yeah this is a pretty legit break so I mean, basically you're bad luck if you cannot afford the digitalized cube but if you can then just go and try this thing out and leave a like on the video right now and let's jump onto the tournament all right guys um, I'm playing this tournament after actually I think this is the first time I'm playing the Singapore tournament because you can see there's zero wins uh, right now, so I think this is the first time maybe I'm gonna be playing Singapore tournament on this account obviously now I think it's gonna be my break yes because the phone vibrated and I'm gonna use backspin I, I don't know I'm, I'm doing this break too much recently and Don't pot anything This is sad No Okay, yeah, I was thinking I'm not gonna lie, I was thinking this was hap this is gonna happen uh, while the cue ball was moving towards the ball. Oh, I called the wrong pocket. I was thinking to actually go for a bank shot and I was going to call the, you know, bottom left pocket, but by mistake, I called the bottom right. So I'm just gonna finish this up like this. Now, let's go for a bank shot, guys, on the red. Because this way, my brown ball is gonna be freed. Yes, that was absolutely perfect. I'm, but. The two problem balls right now are my yellow and purple. That was a super fast shot. Some people say that I lie that I don't tilt my phone and aim. This was, I think, a proof. Look at that. This was that quick. I mean, I'm not saying that this is a plus point or something, but you know, some people just think I lie that I don't tilt my phone. Uh, but I think uh, that was a double bank shot on the purple. That was actually a long bank shot on the purple. But uh, most of the times what happens guys, with me especially when I'm playing tournaments, I go to the final and basically like on the last shot or something, I mess up pretty badly. So I, I think I hopefully am not going to do that once again, but and let's go for a bank shot once again. Now the only thing that I have to be careful about is to use the proper spin because I don't want to mess up the shot on the 8 ball and the force is awesome man. Awesome. All right. So now I think. I'm, yeah. Some people ask me to make a bang shot tutorial. Man, it's important. See, you watch any tutorial on YouTube about bang shots, and you are not gonna make them because it's something that comes naturally. No tutorial can ever, ever make you understand bang shots 100% uh, properly. 
if you don't you know go and practice it because it's stupid I mean how can somebody explain in a video something that you know the person doesn't even have control of I mean bang shots you have to imagine you have to get an idea in your mind I cannot control your mind via a video so you guys should definitely go and practice bang shots that's the only way that you're gonna learn bang shots believe it or not I have never seen a player who has learned bang shot by seeing tutorials on YouTube uh, it's just natural it comes naturally when you practice yourself let's go for a bang shot <laughs> out of all the bang shots I had to miss this when I was giving a lecture on bang shots oh okay wait what did you drink last night? I think it didn't finish off your brain properly, but why? Oh, okay, so he was stuck. It was... Sorry, I'm very sorry. I was rude over here. I was actually rude. I'm not gonna lie, but... He gives me the chance. Now, I don't have to be very happy right now. Because you notice how my green ball is in the... You know, almost the middle of the... Don't scratch. Don't scratch. Alright, so it didn't scratch. Okay, I think I got a plan. I actually have a plan. I now... I called the wrong pocket, I was going for a bank shot, but still I think this plan might work. I only hope I don't put my 8 ball, no! Okay, now I have an official plan. I am gonna go for this, I'm gonna add backspin. Now it's a bank shot time, because this is the only way that I think I can clear my green ball. So bank shot in a crucial moment, let's do this. I hope so that goes in absolutely perfect. Now this is how, this was actually approved guys, how bank shots can help you win games I mean there was basically no other way once again it feels so awesome like every day I get messages from people whom I knew I mean they asked me to give them like a million coins or five million coins stuff like that got today they tell me that they have a billion coins or maybe four billion coins so it's an inspiration guys I'm gonna soon make a video on that yes no yes yes no no, 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 it's not gonna win. But no need to get so happy. If I'm gonna lose this, guys, it's gonna be so sad. This is the final, and I do not want to risk this at any. Okay, I think I think that yellow ball is gonna make our day. Now I'm gonna go over there. I'm gonna add right spin, and um, yeah, I think I'm gonna call the top right pocket. Now this way. Every single thing is going to be cleared. Once again, ball selection is a very important thing if you want to increase points. I mean, which ball do you- <laughs> The red ball saved the cue ball. Like, a uh, Rose saves Jack in Titan. No, she doesn't save him, actually. She's sad. Just go and die. I'm sorry. Uh, actually- Oh! Now what to do? Okay, let's go for a bank shot. Even no, the thing is, even if I go for a bank shot, it won't make any difference because unless and until I don't clear my green ball, it doesn't matter. Oh, I, I missed the bank shot as well. He's obviously looking at me this. Okay, actually, this could make our day. He can scratch in the top right pocket if he uses less force. But let's see what happens. Oh, he missed. Divine luck. This is what I call it. It's called divine luck, guys. But for to compensate for the error and the luck that he had, I'm gonna go for a bank shot, and I'm also gonna win the game by a bank shot. Hopefully, hopefully, I'm not gonna speak too soon because I always say hopefully because uh, okay. So the tournament is for sixty thousand and Q auto recharge for three hundred and fifty thousand. That's a nice bargain. Alright, so I'm gonna add right no okay bad spin, right spin, and I think I don't scratch. Alright, so for the very first time, first attempt, and we won the Singapore tournament. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If yes, do not drop a like. And if you guys did enjoy if you're new to this channel, subscribe absolutely at this very moment. I mean how can you not subscribe to this channel? Give me one reason. Actually there are a thousand reasons. But the thing is if you guys did enjoy it, seriously, leave a like, and I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Enough of chit-chat, and uh, bye.